أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم So we will continue our study of Surah Yusuf. In the last class, uh, ayah number 26 was done. So as usual, we will just uh, briefly revise part of it. And then we will move on to the today's lesson. So uh, I think I've chosen this part. Vashahida shahidum min ahliha in kana kamisuhu kudda min kablin fasalakat. See if we can figure this out, inshallah. If everybody remembers what the words meant and how we're going to relate the words with each other to make a sentence out of it. Okay. Um, I'm going to start with uh, with Burak, inshallah. Burak, can you read up to here? Vashahida shahidun. Vashahida shahidun. Okay, go word by word, please. Wa and shahida. You don't remember the meaning? I'm trying to check my notes. Shahida, Shahida Yashadu, Samiya Yasmao, huh? Saad, do you know the meaning, Shahida? No, yes, Shahida means he witnessed. He witnessed. Okay, Burak, did you hear that? He witnessed. Mm -hmm. Shahida. Mm -hmm. The one who's witnessed. Yeah. The one who witnesses something, can we call that person a witness? Yes. Yes. So Shahidun is, where does it fall in the table of Shahida? Muba, uh, Bu, uh, Burak, sorry. Um, okay, do Shahida. TPI, go out all the way to Shahidun. Do it. Shahidu. Shahidta. Shahidtum. Shahid. Do Shahidna um Yes Hadu Yes Haduna Das Hadu Das Haduna Ash Hadu Nash Hadu Shahid Hold on a second. You're skipping. Oh sorry. Where is Felu Lama? Felu Nahi. Ash Hadu. No, no, it's not Ash Hadu. Ash Hadu, you already it's Felu Mudare. Ashhadu nashhadu. Ish Next had. word. Hmm? Ishhad. Ishhad, yeah. La tashhad. Mm -hmm. Ishhadu. La tashhadu. Mm -hmm. Shahid. Shahidun. Yeah, shahid. What's the meaning meaning now? Um, The one who witness. The word who witness. And in English, the person who witnesses something is called a witness. Do you agree? Yeah. Yeah. Now combine these three words and give me the meaning. And the one who witnessed wit witnessed. I mean, we, I, I'm trying to help you, uh, Burak, so we could make good English translation. Yes. And a witness witnessed. How about that? And a witness witnessed. Yeah, a witness witnessed. All right, good. Thank you. All right, next. Uh, Zainab. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum. So, can you start from men, Zainab? Okay. Min ahliha in kana kami suhu kutta min kuburin fasadaqat mahu. That's good. That's good. Okay. Min from Ahliha, her family. In if Ghana, he was Kamisuhu, his shirt. Kata, he ripped Min from. This is not, listen, listen, uh, hmm? Zainab. Yeah. This is not Kadda. This is what? Kudda. The word over here at the bottom is Kadda. Kadda means he ripped. Mm -hmm. Right? So if he, Kudda means he ripped, what does Kudda mean? 
risk. This is passive voice. So make it the passive voice, please. Um, he was ripped. That's correct. He was ripped. Mean from Kuvulin, um, front. Fa. Fa sadaqat fa so sadaqa, um, truth. Sadaqat means she spoke truth or she was truthful. She wow. was. That's good. That's good. Let's combine up to here. You already done word by word. Let's make a sentence. Wa. Start from wa. Just make a sentence. Okay. And the witness witnessed from her family if he was... No, listen. He, hmm? What's the inside door of Kana? He. He. When inside door is he, what should we do? Look for an outside door. So that'd be Kamisuhu. Kamisuhu. What kind of fragment is Kamisuhu? Mudaf. Uh, yes, it is Mudaf. Like Kitabuhu. So okay. which which dhamma, which page is telling us that it is marfu? Uh, first the page one on or the second? Spot. Sorry. First one. First, first one. one, yeah. What's the status of who here? The who? status of who is also marfu. Don't say that. No, no, no. It's not. You already said Kamisu who is Mudaf Mudafile. Oh, no, it's Jar then, right? Yeah. Who okay. is a Mudafilei and Mudafilei is always, always in jar. My, is in Jar status. Mm -hmm. So, Kamisu, can Kamisu be the outside door of Kana? Yeah. Yeah, okay, now do this accordingly. Okay. If? If his shirt, if his, if his shirt was ripped. It was from, ripped, yeah. It mm -hmm. was ripped from the front, so she was speaking, so she was being truthful. Yeah, fog also means then. Then, then she, she was, was truthful. truthful, or she was speaking the truth. Yeah, good mm -hmm. job. Good job. Thank you. He said, she seduced me and a witness from her family, from the family of the woman witnessed, if his shirt was ripped from the front. Then she is truthful. She was truthful. And he is from those who lie. All right, next ayah. Today's lesson. <clears throat> We're going to do again word by word, inshallah. Um, and I'm going to ask Anusha. Yes, as alaykum. Wa alaykum Go ahead, Nusa. Read, re, re, sorry, read the ayah. Okay. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Wa in kana qabisu tuhu kudda min tuhurin fakadzabat wa huwa min al-sadiqin. No, this is not kazabat. Kazabat. Fakadzabat. Fakadzabat. Kazabat. Yeah, that's good. Okay, go word by word, please. Um, wa and n f kana. He was Kamisu, his shirt, Kutta, ripped. No. No, he, not ripped. Listen, oh. listen. Uh, oh. Nusha, whenever you translate a verb, you have to include a doer in it. Okay? Kutta is a verb. So mm -hmm. you cannot just say ripped. No. There is no doer in it. It has to have a doer. So try again, please. Uh. I said he ripped. He was ripped. Oh, he was ripped. Oh. In this case, there is no doer. It is an acting doer in there, right? Yeah. A doer or acting doer should be in there. So you should mention that when you translate a verb. So kudda, kudda means he ripped. Kudda is a passive voice. He was ripped. Okay. He was okay. ripped. Let's continue. Okay. Men from Tuburan mm -hmm. back. You see, um, kubulin, kubulin, duburin. Do they rhyme? Yeah. Yeah. Kubul means front, dubur, dubur means back. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Duburin, back, back, so. Then, then. Uh, then, kadabat. Um, mm -hmm. You know, kadabat, what's the meaning of kadabat? 
Kazaba means he lied. He lied. What's she the meaning lied. of Kazabat? Yeah, she lied. She lied. Mm -hmm. And who he mean from a those who tell the truth. Very good. Combine. And if the shirt was no 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 it's not the shirt something else and Red. and okay oh and if his shirt was ripped from the back then um she lied and he is from the one who tells the truth yeah very good did a good job uh, anusha very well done thank you yes. Very good. So did you see over here, kana kamisuhu? If we just focus here, kana kamisu. What kind of sentence is this? Jumla ismiya, jumla fairia. What do you think? That's um, jumla fairia. Yeah, we will talk more about this, but at this time we just call it jumla fairia. Good. Because kamisuhu is the outside door of kana. And the inside door will just go away, disappear. Inside door. All right, next, let's go to the next ayah. Yeah, we have time. Um, and I'm going to ask Musab. Musab Iqbal, are you there? Yes, Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum Musab. Go ahead, read the ayah. <laughs> That's good. That's good enough. Dub min duburin. Up to here. Ah, so lama when raa raa ah he saw. No. How did you read it again? Read read this word again, please. Raa. Raa. Yeah. It's not raa. Yeah. No. Raa. Raa means he saw. He saw. Good. Kamisahu his shirt. Mm -hmm. Could the ripped men... He was ripped. He could the he was ripped mm -hmm. from Dubrin behind. Okay. Behind or back, that's okay. Yeah, good. Combine it. So when he saw his shirt was ripped from behind. Behind. Good job. Can I say Kamisa who can Kamisa who be the outside doer of Ra'a? Because Ra'a inside doer is he, right? Can it Kamisa who be the outside doer? Uh, yes. No. Yes? No. Yes or no? No. Why no? Because it's Kamisa. It's Kamisa who. So what's the status of Kamisa who? Rafa Nasab or Jar? Nasab. Nasab. Can outside doer be of Nasab status? No. What status it's supposed to have? Rafa. Rafa. So, Kamisa who can never be the outside doer. It cannot replace the inside doer of Ra'a. So, yes. inside doer will stay. It will not go anywhere. So, when he saw his shirt ripped or it was ripped from the back, from behind. Good. Good job, uh, Musab. Very well done. All right. Dania. Yes. Read the remaining ayah, please. Okay. Qala innahu min kun inna kayda kun na'adheem. Qala, he said, Innahu indeed he min from a kaidi kun he he planned no, he no 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 listen hold on a second first the first word for kaid kada yakidu kada yakidu what chapter I mean, uh, come from Bab Ajraf Sara Yasiru very good what does kada mean kada means he planned he planned or he schemed also is a word, huh? But is Kaid then? Is it Al Madi, Al Mudare, Failul Amar, Failul Nahi? What is it? Failul Amar? Kaid is Amar? Yeah. Are you sure? Um, okay. okay, let's do Kada. Do the TPA of Kada. Okay. Kada, Kadu, 
Is it kid over here? You said it is failure number. Did you not say that? Uh, uh, I mean, like, uh, I mean, Masdar. Yeah, you got it now. So, this is not failure number. Failure number is kid. Kid. La ta kid. So, if it is not, uh, then ki do. La ta ki do. So, is this will come right at the end. So, kaid mean? Kaid means um, a plan. Plan or a scheme. A Kaidi scheme. Kunna. What does this mean? Um, you were uh, your scheme. Your scheme. Who are you here? A bunch um, of the um the uh, the uh, the woman. A woman. So it's a bunch of women. Kaidi kunna. Can you start from kaidi ha and reach kaidi kunna? Okay. Kaidi ha. Kaidi hunna. Kaidi hinna. Kaidi hinna. Kaidi ki. Kaidi kunna. Kaidi kunna. Very good. So, how you will translate this again? Your, um, your scheme. Your scheme. And over here, your means a bunch of women. Correct? Yes. Yeah, a group of women. Okay. Next. Inna, indeed, kaida, kaida kunna, your scheme, uh -huh. Avi. Sorry. Um, Azim, um, uh, punishment. No, 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 Azim. No, no, it doesn't mean punishment. Anybody who knows the word Azim from the class, raise your hand. Uh, great, great, great. What's the first word? Okay, we got it already. Uh, Azim, what's the first word? For Azuma, ya Azumu. Azuma, ya Azam, ya Bab Karumayakrimu. Thank you, um, Arham. So Azim means great. It also means big. Hmm? Not only great, but also it means big, something big. Okay, combine from Kala. Okay. Um he said indeed he is from your scheme. Indeed, your scheme is great. Or you can say are great or are big. Hmm? Uh, are big. Yeah. So in, you can also say in these it is from. Huh? Instead of saying he, we can also say it. So can you start from falamma and go all the way to the end? Translation just. Okay. Falamma. No, no, not word by word. Just English. Oh, okay. So not yet he saw his... Um, no. What did you say by word lamma? Not yet. Oh no. Yeah, it, I'm glad you mentioned that now. We can we can talk about it. Lamma means sometimes it means not yet. Over here it doesn't mean not yet, not yet. Can somebody tell me where does it mean not yet? What will be the situation when lamma will mean not yet? Okay. Uh, Brother Abdul Mujib Muhammad, can you tell me that? Yeah, so when uh, it is followed by a mudare, so basically it's something in the present tense or like future tense. Right. But if it is followed by a past tense, then it should mean when. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Thank you, Brother Abdul Mujib. Did you hear that? Um, um, Daniel? Actually, can you read it? Because I didn't hear it. Oh, okay. I, I just repeat that. So when Lamma comes, and after Lamma is al fayl mudare then this Lamma is one of the Jawazim al fayl mudare and it means not yet. But when after Lamma, you see, though you don't see a fail, al fayl al mudare which is the case here. Ra is Madare or Madi? Uh, Madi. Madi. So now Lamma does not mean not yet. Okay. 
it means when. Oh, okay. okay. You remember this now, forever. Okay. Okay, Daniel? Okay. Inshallah. All right, now translate. So when he saw his shirt ripped from the back, he said, indeed, it is from your scheme. Indeed, your scheme is are big. Is big. Your schemes are. Your scheme is big. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, singular. We can say singular. That's good. It's 51 minutes, so I will stop here. And uh, now we can go to the breakout room, inshallah.